All right, so quick update on the last like three weeks of my life. Um, I went to Colorado for a week and a half, which uh, I posted in my last two vlogs, and then I went back to Austin for two days, and then hopped on a plane, and now I am. All right, and now I am in the south of France. Um, I have a beach house here. My family has a beach house here, and we come back every year for two months. Um, so I was born here. Uh, I moved to the States. I was five years old. Um, and then so I've been living there for 15 years, but we have all of our family in France So we come back every summer and see them so I'm gonna be here for the next couple months But since I'm in Europe and since I'm already here It's so much cheaper to travel because you can just take the train or a quick plane. So I'm going a little bit everywhere Okay, so the town I'm in is called Fronchignan. All right one sec terrible lighting, but look how amazing this guy looks right now Wow, that's beautiful. Okay, so my town is called Fonchignang. Uh, it's a tiny little town. Most people don't know about it. The biggest town next to us, or city, is called Montpellier. That one's a little bit more popular. Um, so we're staying here for the entire summer. I'm actually heading to Paris on uh, Saturday. Today is Thursday, so in a couple days. I'm going up there just for two days, because I don't know, Paris is cool and just why not. And then Monday I hop on a plane. I'm going to Greece for five days. I have a really good friend of mine up there, so I'm gonna go hang out with him. He does a bunch of filming too, so we're gonna get some crazy shots with drones and stuff. I'll actually put his Instagram right here. And then I head back to Paris that Friday, so the 14th, spend the night there, hop on a train, and then I come back to my town and I'll be back Saturday. So the one thing I'm super bummed out about is um, I've been wanting to film like fireworks with the drone so bad. And so for the 14th of July in France is Bastille Day, which is just like the 4th of July for Americans. And I was like so excited this summer, I was gonna film it with the drone, but I'm gonna be on the freaking plane heading back from Greece. So I'm not gonna be able to film it, which is such a bummer. Um, so I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I might leave the drone here and have somebody else fly it. I don't know, but we're gonna figure that one out. So here's my big dilemma. I ordered a French SIM card like a week ago so I could have it for my trip since I'm gone for an entire week and my phone only works with Wi-Fi right now because it's still under my US phone contract or whatever. SIM card still not in, so I'm gonna go check if it's here now. I've checked every like 30 minutes for the past like two days. Really pissed off. Everything takes so much longer to get delivered here, which is super annoying. So we're gonna go see if it's here. All right, mailbox is right here. I'm gonna go check if it's here. Literally the greatest day of my life. I've been checking the mailbox every day, like 10 times a day, and I'm pretty sure it's in one of these things. If it's not, I'm literally gonna flip out. That was the SIM card, we're all good. Now I just need to activate it. Hopefully that doesn't take another four freaking days to happen. So we'll see how that goes. So now that I have a phone, I need to get a suitcase because I only brought a massive suitcase to come here, but I need a little carry-on one. So I gotta go buy a suitcase, pack, and be ready by tomorrow, 9 a.m. It's 7 p.m. right now. Okay, I finally got my SIM card ready and updated and everything. Oh my god, it took an hour and a half to even do that. I ordered the thing like a week and a half ago and it just got here a day before the trip. It's just insane how long it takes for things to get here. Um, I guess it's just because the US is so fast, I'm not used to it in France anymore. But whatever, it's done. I'm not going to complain about it anymore. Um, so now the only thing I need to do is find a suitcase and then pack it. Um, and then be ready to leave for tomorrow. Um, I'm not really good at these packing things. I usually wait until like the last second and that's really what I'm doing right now. Um, but yeah, hopefully it all works out and I'm good to hop on the train tomorrow. All right, I got a suitcase. Now we need to go find a printer somewhere because I need to print my train ticket for tomorrow morning. All right, got my tickets, got my passport. I'm all packed, it's before midnight, okay, it's 12.01, same thing. Um, I'm waking up at 8 a.m., heading to the train station, hopping on the train, going to Paris, and then I'll be there for two days. See y'all tomorrow morning. And I'm leaving my house, going to the train station, and then getting on the train. Um, so now, right now, I'm going to put the edit of there's my house and the beach that I made real quick with the drone, um, so that's going to start now. Cheese, they sway me Each night and each day I'm California dreaming about you Oh yeah 
look at this world class view But it's you that I think about every time when my mind's on it And it's you that I think about every time when I feel alone And it's you that I call on my FaceTime when I need something real oh, yeah. I work the night shift till late in the PM I'm California dreaming So if you guys enjoyed that, enjoy this vlog, let me know in the comments, leave a like, um, and then so next episode I will be in Paris. Peace out.